Is a pen mod from AliExpress good for a beginner? Ajigao mods are good for me. What do you think about random version of Zhigao mod, Alex? I think it is a useless waste of time, money and... Guys, I literally feel my skill degenerating while using it. Hello Spinner, you're on Penstock, a channel about pen spinning, and today I'm gonna reply to these questions. I received them way too often and decided to reply once and for all. What I'm going to do today is even crazier than doing Twisted Sonic Busts 10 hours straight online. Are you done it? If you haven't seen, go and click the card or link in the description under this video. But today, oh man. Today I'm gonna do, guys, something gross. Those of a nervous disposition should immediately turn this video off. Don't try to repeat it at home. Ladies and gentlemen, today I'm gonna review Jigao mod. Stick for pen spinning, at least how it is described on AliExpress. Jigao became a symbol of how you should not make mods. The reason why we hate factory made mods. The main tool for those who are going to forget about pen spinning in a few months, because it is impossible to learn anything with it. I mean, they don't even know for sure what pen spinning is. As basically, Jigao Stationery is a Chinese company which produces stationary stuff. Pens, pencils, note sheets, other other stuff like that. They have a very pale idea of what pen spinning is about. So with their odd jobs they have aggrieved our beloved hobby more than than anything else ever. I've tried several Jigao mods and none of them was even close to be appropriate for spinning. I've been not wanting to make this review for several months, but you always keep asking me for it, so I can't resist any longer. Let's start the sacrifice. I need to make this review of this and save the whole this place from being cursed by destroying this abomination. Yeah, first of all, don't forget to leave a like in advance for all the tortures I've passed through while doing this video. So, I ordered it a while ago, was very upset of doing it. In about two months I got it by mail and, and it was a dark day. By the way, I've ordered two different mods, but luckily the second one was lost on its way. I guess it was even worse than this one, because this one was more expensive. So I received only one tool, sorry, I don't know which version of Jigao this is, write in the comment section below if you know, and be ashamed of knowing this stuff. I don't know much about different sorts of shit. Anyway, it is completely useless information. You know, guys, usually I have a lot to say about different pen mods, but today I don't know what to say. It feels bad, looks ugly, spins awful. Well, no, it doesn't look that ugly, all these monsters. I think my four years old daughter could find them cute. For me, it looks like a low quality, obnoxious, shiny thing. Compare it with a nice flower V2, for example. I have noticed a funny thing, even though it looks like crap, what the hell it is? Some kind of caps? Anyway, even though it looks like this, it has a cool benefit. These caps are pretty quiet when being dropped on a table. We all hate it, don't we? When mod falls on a table, hitting it with a tip, leaving marks and waking up all the demons from the deepest soul bottoms of those who are near. These caps are not out of rubber, it is a cheap plastic, but it was really smart to make these ends soft. So when you drop Jigao on a table, the sound is muted. It is much more quiet than the one which, for example, waterfall makes, falling down flat on its grips. That is cool, isn't it? Well, it would have been cool if only Jigao knew what they were doing. But since they don't give a shit about pen spinning, they totally f up this only advantage converting it to the one of the worst disadvantages of this. How the hell did they come up with an idea of putting these hard plastic rings on these caps? You are also wrong if you think that whole this cap is soft. No, only it's steep. So mod is quiet only when you drop it vertically, which, you know, 
doesn't happen often. And even if it does fall vertically, it is going to fall flat as well. That's how physics works. And boy, are they allowed. If we compare waterfall being dropped vertically at its tip, which also doesn't happen often, right? In most cases it falls on grips or at least at the side of a tip, which makes less noise than dropping straight on tip. Even if waterfall would fall on its tip vertically at 90 degrees angle, it would make much less noise and this noise would be much lower than Jigao's. Because when I hear Jigao, it feels like head on impact. Loud, high frequency sound, which is very hard to stand. Okay, enough about pros, let's speak a little bit about some contours. First of all, writing ink. All factory made mods or FMMs unfortunately have writing ink inside. Guys, it is not good for a pen mod to be writable, at least for beginners. And all FMMs are for beginners. Don't think any pro uses Jigao or Flower Syria or Spin Pro or whatever. Right now there are no FMMs suitable for advanced or even intermediate pen spinner. They are not the best choice for advanced pen spinner, especially when they try to mix writing tool with pen spinning tool. Flower Syria is okay though. Check out the review of these mods if you want to have a good factory made mods. Pay attention on them, but don't forget to take ink out. Jigao reminds me of the, those Chinese iPhones copy with television inside. They even may look like a phone from a distance, but in fact hardly can perform their main function. The same goes to Jigao. Of course, any skilled pen spinner looks at it as at a sheet, but for a beginner it looks somehow like a pen mod, and when he gets it, he realizes that it hardly can spin due to its completely screwed balance. We go, you want to have a good time spinning your mod, instead you just freak out, because this garbage doesn't want to spin as it, it is meant to, you're gonna notice it very soon, right while trying to make your first linkages. It is very hard to control and this hardness is not challenging, it is very annoying. And Jigao doesn't give you anything instead of good control, instead of any control. Its momentum sucks, it doesn't spin, and even if it does, it spins in random directions, which affects your style. So all you get out of spinning Jigao is rage. It is like playing Fallout 76, it just doesn't work. And some beginners, a lot of them actually, begin to think that pen spinning in general doesn't work, at least for them. But in fact it is the same as trying to learn some BMX tricks on a tricycle. What are tricycles for? Give you a concept of moving with pedals. Is it possible to make tricks on it? Yeah, probably, but would it be so fun as on an appropriate thing? Yeah, you can learn some fundamentals on Jigao, Sonic, Tamburan, Charge. By the way, recently I made a cool video about nice way to learn charge, check it out. So these tricks, except for charge continues of course, you can learn with Jigao. But that's it, it's all that it can be used for. To move forward you will need something better. So what's the point on wasting money on Jigao? You can learn fundamentals with your self-made mods, for, with Victory for example. Their purpose is just give you an idea of pen spinning and keep you busy for the one, two first weeks, while you are waiting for an actual pen mod from penstock.net. Because that is how long it usually takes to receive a package with a nice signed card from me. After the first two, maximum three weeks, you will need something else, like Flower Syria, Flying Panda, Ivan mod, Something like that, you can't move forward with your self mod and especially with Jigao. The only problem is you're going to wait for it to come from AliExpress for at least 4 weeks. Remember, I've been waiting for it for 8 weeks. It is enough for being prepared to play some simple games on spinball.com, of course if you practice with a normal mod. In 4 weeks you will not need Jigao at all. As it would arrive, you are going to find out that it actually is worse than your self mod. If you want to create something decent, if you spend enough time on doing researches of how to make a pen for pen spinning, if you find suitable spare parts for making such a pen, you will be able to make 
pretty fine self mod. But even not that good self mod will be much better than this unspinnable stick. You wanna lose time, money and skill? Go to AliExpress and order this garbage. Otherwise, join our Discord server, like and share this video, subscribe to Penstock because it is the right channel for high quality pen spinners. I'm Alex Sukhov. May this tale be with you. Bye.